for the new barbers coming out, I would recommend that you guys stay very humble and very hungry. If you stay humble, people will always want to work with you and, and, and will enjoy working with you. But if, and if you stay hungry, you'll always want to work because you're going to get that, that drive and that, that drive is going to feed that hunger. And so for new guys, stay humble and hungry, you know, attend shows and, and just make yourself a presence for companies that you may potentially want to work for. And don't just be a behind the chair barber, be a outside of the box barber, meaning, you know, get with companies and, and showcase your talent on a, on a corporate level and show companies that, hey, this is why you should work with me and this is what I can do. And, and, and I think you will love what you do better and you'll get a better understanding for our industry if you attacked it that way. And like I said, show your face at hair shows and not just feel like I'm a barber and I'm just behind the chair and this is what I do on an everyday basis because I'm a barber. Now for the, the seasoned veterans in this industry, the, you know, guys such as myself, I feel like we should, we should always be able to think outside of the box. You know, everybody's comfortable with what they've been doing for so long that it's kind of like routine where we just stay in our comfort zone and don't want to get out of it. But, you know, for me, I can only speak for myself. I, I challenge myself to get outside the box sometime and really get out of my element and put myself in a different element and see how, how I perform and how I grow by challenging myself. And I think as a seasoned barber or, you know, a, a veteran in this industry as a barber that I would want all of us to do the same thing to help us grow. And, you know, we all don't know everything and somebody else can teach us something. A young guy could teach me something. But if I was a seasoned veteran that was closed minded, then I would definitely turn him away and, and shy him away. But, you know, as a seasoned veteran, I, I'm open to still learn from anybody. So please, as veterans, you know, get outside the box, think outside the box and, and each one teach one.